about this shit. I don't pay attention to it. It's just that when they, they have to literally put it in front of your face in order to make you care about it, which you don't because you're the person that's conducting these acts. So it doesn't matter. You can see on the back of the chair, there's some kind of image. Um, I can't make out anything, but it already looks like a person's body kind of I can't really tell I can't make that one out but these fools do it all day and then I'll show you a uh, um, but pretty much this is like initiation for a lot of these perps like if a girlfriend is cheating on their boyfriend they'll fucking put their shit embedded into videos and then what these fools will do is um you know is put it like on your your feed or whatever and even if it that's not the case they they're trying to make you think that that's the case so it doesn't really matter you have to kind of know the person in order to figure everything out but it's also something that they they you know, just like the human trafficking and, you know, people selling out, it's like a ritual. If they desecrate their bodies and put it, you know, everywhere for people to see, they're accepted by this perp community. They're accepted because they're willing to sell out. And so that's why there's a lot of imagery in the background. There's a lot of, you know, editing that takes place in making videos because a lot of these people either the AI is changing the picture or they're you know purposely doing it themselves because they want to be accepted and the only way they know how is to follow the program is to please the people behind the scenes So if you see right there where it says best and you look up to the left of the first fan, it looks like a woman's legs, her buttocks and the back of somebody's back. All right. So that's just that. But maybe that's just what I see. Maybe because I've watched too much shit in the past, but I doubt it. I know that they're um, purposely putting stuff in that is sexual. You see. There's a girl in the background right there in the poster. I think, I'm not sure, but I can show you to a video that I have and just to prove how they do this. But there usually is a lot of stuff like you see right here in this in this video in this left the left hand side between the two laser beams of light, there's a girl bending over. And then there's two girls next to them, but it's just an image. They like to like copy and paste a bunch of similar things, you know, so that you can't make it out. A matter of fact, um, I'll show you guys a video right now. This is a video that somebody was sent to me. And I'm going to show you guys in a second. Alright, so you see the guy in the white shirt. Look at the TV next to him. There's a freaking girl bending over right there. Like, it's stupid. Like, I don't care about that shit. I'm just going to expose it. So if they keep putting this shit up, like, I don't want to see it. If I wanted to watch some fucking porn or something, then I would go watch it. But when they're putting it on everything, it's like they're trying to make you focus on it. They're trying to make you care. But... See, the way of their thinking is sick. They like that stuff. They know what to click on. When they see a video, that shit, they'll get a notification and they'll already know what to expect. And they're probably shown the actual footage of something. They're shown the actual footage, but we're not shown 
you know, as a targeted individual, you're not showing what's actually happening while people that are supposedly TIs are watching your targeting or watching the things that are going on behind your back. And that's why they're drawn to a lot of this stuff. They're working on the inside, um, seeing all the perversion. And why would you even participate in it? You can't be a man of God and be contributing to their way of thinking because it's it's perverse. It's worse than watching anything on your own because what they're doing is displaying it. it's like to try to hurt somebody and they're doing this to a fucking shit ton of people I already know they are um and uh this shit doesn't affect me this shit's old i've seen this for a long time but see what they want you to do is they want you to just stay quiet and and you know and feel some kind of way about it you know and just be quiet and be like oh you know fucking people are fucked up and whatever you gotta expose that shit, bro. That's what you gotta do. See, putting that finger in his mouth, shh, shh, not whispers. Fuck all that. You know, I'm exposing everything. So I'm gonna show you guys right now. It's just that they want attention, they want views, they want to be noticed. So the only way they know how is to sell out. All right, so right here on the left-hand corner where there's like a little flash, I can see something there, an embedded image right behind that flash. I don't know what it is, but I can see something. Um, let's see what else. Oh, here, <laughs> right in the middle of the picture, there's a fucking naked person all up in this video. And necessarily, it doesn't mean that it's targeted towards you. It's just they they use a lot of they use a lot of uh, perversion. Mm. It's a way to sell out. It's like a ritual. <laughs> That's full. And a lot of people are dabbling with this shit, and. I don't know. That ain't me. I don't really care for it. They've tried showing me stuff and like I'll switch the video. I don't I don't really care for it. I don't care what they do. That's that's your guys' shit. I don't I don't really give a shit. You guys keep on doing that shit, I don't care. That ain't me, it's not part of me. And I'm not never gonna make it part of me. I'm never gonna be like you people are. The ones that are so easily to give into the negative to contribute to it and to like feed that shit. I'm good. So this is another one right here. You can obviously tell on the right hand side there's some kind of embedded image. Pansexual. This shit's all sexual. This one probably too. If you see all kinds of bullshit in the background, like you see the smoke and mirrors and bullshit, there's most likely some perjured shit in the background. I'm not sure. Sometimes there's nothing. Sometimes there is. But Lion of Judah, he I like his channel, so I wouldn't I wouldn't ever think, you know, they would participate in doing any any perverted shit like that. So sometimes I think it's the AI that's altering things. And then sometimes it could be your perception, but I never noticed this stuff before. And for some reason, I'm seeing a lot of it. So I know it ain't me. It has to be some fucking algorithm or some bullshit that they're that they're trying to embed in a lot of uh, videos.
because like somebody will post like somebody will post a video and within like five if they if they have a popular channel within five minutes it'll have like so many views already but it's because what they're viewing isn't the same thing that you are they're viewing some other shit if you're part of the perp community you get these benefits where you get to see these people and the things that they do behind closed doors that's one of the perks of being a perp is all this perversion I don't know if you see this in front of me, but it's more perverted shit. And I don't like this shit on my channel. So if you guys want to keep putting it, I'm just going to keep exposing it. I don't really give a shit. Um, that shit doesn't affect me. It doesn't bother me anymore because I used to not dwell on it, but I used to kind of like consider it because you know they put it in front of your face because they want you to focus on it but if you don't pay attention to it just keep on moving like unsubscribe from their channels or whatever but see that's the thing if the ai is doing it to you and it's a channel you like you have to know how to know if it's the people that are going along with it or if it's the ai and know which ones to unsubscribe from so So let's see. Okay. Okay, so this video right here. If you see on the bottom here, where it's all like messing up and stuff, and in the backgrounds, there's like weird shit going on. Um, I'm gonna upload the video to like a sharing thing so you guys can see it if you want. But there's a lot of bullshit going on here that I could see, and it's crazy how they're embedding stuff. into videos that you record even in your own videos and what they do is people will attach um like say say like somebody that's in the perk program or whatever they um they upload a video or they have an instagram or a snapchat or whatever their videos will be embedded with shit that they've done with other girls or somebody that you know and so then they're uh they'll try to show you a video and in the background there's embedded shit that you might catch but you can't prove but um that's their whole little get down it's it's the way that they do things their perversion is spread um from perp to perp they share all their perverted crap and <laughs> it's funny, like, they have to go so far to, like, try to even get any kind of reaction. But, like I said, focus on the things that are good. Don't focus on none of this crap. I just want to expose it and shame the devil and what he does. You know, I'm not perfect, but... I don't give in to their shit. Anything that has to do with them or is part of them, I don't go along with it. I don't want nothing to do with it. So get the fuck off my channel. Get off my feed. Take all your privilege shit somewhere else because that shit doesn't affect me, first of all. And I'm going to expose it, second of all. And third of all, they failed already. So it doesn't matter. I always prevail against their weak shit 
have videos I want to upload, but I can't because YouTube will take them down. But I'll figure a way around it. I'll probably um, put some like blocking of the face or any body or whatever. And uh, I might show it or not. I don't know. We'll see. I'll see. I'll see what's up. Peace.